welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for watching. Today we have another taste test. I feel like it's been a long time, but it's only been a month. The Ish. last month has been long. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. If you've been following, you, you know it's been an extra long month, I suppose, right now for us. But nonetheless, we have a vegan cuts taste test for you guys today. If you are not familiar with vegan cuts, I will totally have it linked below for you guys. I do have a $5 off uh, code you can use to get your box, but it is a monthly subscription service of nothing but vegan friendly snacks. This is good. This is good stuff. Good snacks. Good snacks. As long as they're not well, dill flavored. As long as they're not dill. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we have been trying these out for you guys month to month for over a year now. We have yeah, a lot of fun like doing it. Yeah. It's cool. It's been a long time. It's like a year and a half. I know. It's been a long, yeah. long time. We highly recommend it. I know a lot of you have purchased it over the months and really enjoy it too. It's just really cool. A lot of the times they'll throw in just, of course, a snack item, uh, but then sometimes it is like full-size items too. It's just a good way to try different things. So we really enjoy it and I definitely recommend it. So oh, check yeah. it out. Linked below. But should we just get into it? We ate breakfast, but that's it. Mm. And it's almost three. Yeah, I was gonna say. It's kind of time. We ate breakfast, but doesn't mean I'm not hungry. Doesn't mean I'm not ready for it. But uh, <laughs> anyway, guys, if you enjoy, please do give this video a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. It helps us out a lot. Let's see. Let's do it. Let's do it. I did open the box beforehand. Sometimes they will actually put in here uh, like drinks and stuff. So they went through a spell, I feel like, of where month after month we were trying new energy drinks or coffee drinks or combos of that. Mm -hmm. And then we had a good spurt there where they didn't have like any drinks at all. But yeah. sometimes. But we did put this in the fridge first uh, just for a few days. Uh, so it would be good to try for you guys cold. Now I think yeah. we have tried this before, but maybe a different flavor. A different is this flavored? Or? Oat milk latte. It's by Rise Nitro Brewing Company Oat Milk Latte. I feel like I've seen Rise yeah. before somewhere, but I don't know if we've yeah. tried it. I we'll think we've just seen it. Yeah, Nitro Cold Brew Coffee. We will just give it a shot. You already shook this. I did. I, sometimes you're not supposed to. Sometimes you are. Sometimes they don't tell you. Let's just... We are not supposed to. Oh, she's simmered down. Oh, she's she fine. smells good. I'm obsessed with coffee. Obsessed in all forms. But actually, a lot of the times, these are the kinds of drinks that I don't love. Yeah, like I don't know. The, the energy coffee you don't mm -mm. go for because it can kind of have that like medicine-y. Yeah, nope, I don't like it. Oh. Nope, it's, it's just not... And it's oat milk too, which is kind of still new to me. Like, I'm not obsessed with oat milk yet, but I'm trying. <laughs> It's not, okay, it's not awful. It's just it's, not me. It's different. Yeah. I mean, Ooh. I don't, it's kind of bitter. And I actually really like just plain coffee, but. Well, it's nitro too. Yeah, so it's supposed it's to different. be kind of like that silkier style. Yeah. I, it's uh, the sweetener or something in it. Yeah, what's in it? Just water, coffee. Sunflower oil. oil. Hmm. Sea salt, potassium. I, I just, it's not a favorite for me, but. Yeah. It's, it's okay. okay. It's just, it, it's its own little flavor. You right. have to like it. You're either right. going to like it or you're going to go, that's not the coffee style that but I like. But you didn't like it. But you didn't, do you know what that's from? But, oh, oh, so you saw it, but you didn't like it. Oh, I loved seeing those pictures of you on your vacation. Yeah, but you didn't yeah, like it. Yeah, but you it. didn't like it. <laughs> Let's move on to a food item. I am eyeballing this yeah. cookie. We're getting things set up as well. Is that a cookie? Is that a cookie? I have not seen this brand. Uh, just It says cookie with like a plus symbol. Oh, I've seen it. Have you? In there? Uh, cookie plus protein uh, cookie. In the, in the world. Have you seen it? I haven't seen this. In the Cookie plus. I've seen cookie really? plus. Really? I haven't. No. It's, it's, Where have it's you been shopping that I have not seen this? You didn't go shopping for a month. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, two grams of fiber, chocolate chip is just a plain old cookie, 12 grams of protein. I'm into this. You Let's know what's it. good news? This whole cookie, let's we'll see how big it is, is only one serving. Sometimes they get you. Right. You know? Right. Oh, that's not bad. That's pretty decent. How many calories? 230. So it's kind of, you know, like a protein. That's not bad for 12 protein. Soft, they can two. tell you that. Oh, baby. Choo choo. Choo choo. <laughs> Ready? Okay. Okay. Ooh. 
Ooh. Ah. Oh. Mm. It's like the chip. <laughs> Any more sounds? Got it's else? like a big yeah. um, Chips Ahoy Chewy one. Yeah. Ones. Yeah. I'm sorry, I'm gonna just say it here and now. This is much, much better than the um, <laughs> the Lenny and Larry ones or Larry and Lenny. Yeah, and I feel like this might even be less calories. I think so. Because that one is two servings. Mm hmm. This is good. They're good. Well, for you, just chocolate chip. Just chocolate chip. Yeah, get some. Yeah, what's in it? Kosher. Probably just pea protein. Um. Raw sugar, faba bean protein. Ew, that's good. Now it's not gluten free, which I, we don't eat gluten free um, entirely. But I will tell you, most of the items in Vegan Cuts Box in general um, mm. are are uh, gluten free as well. It's all faba bean protein. There's no other like protein. That is in good. It. I love it. Damn, that's really good. That's solid. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm excited to try out this one, and it's kind of funny because I'm pretty sure this was the one that someone did share with us on Facebook, mm -hmm. like asking, have we tried it yet? Yeah. And I swear it was this brand, and I was like, no. Now, okay, I never really liked pork rinds. Like, I, I, no. I don't want to say I don't like them. I just don't think I've really ever had them. Like, I've never liked them Have you before. had them, like, I, I, years I, ago? I've had them yeah. years and I years ago. I probably had to, but... I, mm, yeah. I mean, we had a pig. The idea of eating it just <laughs> right. <laughs> wasn't well, for me even prior to going vegan. It just yeah. wasn't appealing. I'd rather have a Dorito. <laughs> it, it kind of goes back to that whole like um, separating yourself from what you're really yeah. eating kind yeah. of concept. Like if you actually look up what a pork rind is and yeah. the process of making a pork that's gross. That's gross. <laughs> I'm not into it. That's gross. <laughs> no, but um, but I get but that yeah. they are a big favorite, especially for those on keto because they mm -hmm. are a lower carb chip. So I totally get it. I do. Yeah. At the end of the day, when it's a crunchy and salty, like chip crunchy, like that's what someone's looking for. So right. I get it. I'm sure there's a good flavor to it. But this is called Pig Out. Yeah. Pigless pork rinds. I like the pig. I, like the pig. <laughs> I do. The I do. Speaking of which, we didn't even mention. Show us oh. Angel. Oh, Angel. That's this, this one this month. This that's month awesome. Is Angel in Wyoming. Yeah. So every Vegan Cuts box that is purchased is uh, they donate a little bit to a different farm sanctuary like yeah. throughout, which is awesome. And they always like put a picture. It's of, like the most elegant I cow know. I've ever seen I know. in my life. Just they don't they don't really have like a strong no not really like not bad but for just, barbecue it's not like oh is it barbecue flavor Texas barbecue I'm sorry I didn't even realize. I love barbecue chips. That's like, I'm basic, I guess. I like just barbecue. Ooh. Okay, I love it, but I couldn't necessarily tell you if it compares. You know what I'm saying? Like, since I'm not like... Right, I haven't had a pork rind in... Uh-huh. Over a decade. But honestly... Mmm. No, it's good. It kind of just reminds me of like, um, like a pop chip. Yeah, it was like a super, a super hearty one. It's really good. They're not like, they're not like little, st I mean, they're really, they're thick. I mean, they're big. All right, they're really they're good. good. They're good. Another one in here, we can try it at another time, but sometimes they'll throw in stuff like this too, where it's like oatmeal or a different kind of like rice alternative. They actually did that this time. Now I can speak to this real quick. I've actually had this, so I'm going to save it. You're not the biggest fan of this. I love it. it. I do really like it. But to be fair, you're just not a big fan of like pasta and rice alternatives anyway. You don't hate all of them, but like they're just not your favorite. There's a lot of them where I'm just like, mm -hmm. I don't, mm -hmm. if I'm going to have rice, right. it's got to be texturally right. similar to like But see, rice. I feel like this is. You didn't. Mm. You didn't think so. It's not. You. You could be wrong. You're wrong. You could be wrong. <laughs> I've actually. I want to say I've even had the lemon pepper one. This is the right rice made from vegetables. Um, it's. It's got some good protein in it, and it's basically made of chickpea flour and rice flour. It's like a blend. Oh, yeah. I really enjoyed it. I got the garlic herb one before too. Liked that. Uh, you can find these at Whole Foods at Sprouts. But yeah. But it's cool to throw these kinds of things in there too. But. Yeah, Nate's not a big fan of pasta. I'm not a big, He's just not. I'm not a big fan of chickpea. 
I yeah. think that's what it is. Yeah. I think pretty much everything we should that. be, it's just like, meh. You're kind of whatever. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's well, cool. you're wrong. Also, they threw in a, like, uh, tummy and travel friendly too. Okay. Bene Bevi sorry. Beviva Purpo all-in-one cereal with pre and probiotics. It's, it's essentially, wait, is it just a cereal, like, without, like, no, you still have to, cold water. Watch it turn purple. Hold on! We gonna try this! What? Okay. Give me my spoon! Where's my spoon? <laughs> oh. <laughs> One. One. We can do this. Pour oat milk, and they spell it M-Y-L-K, powder into cup. Save pouch. This is too much. Empty pouch with cold water. Stir. Watch it turn purple. Top with granola and enjoy. Thank you. Did you get that? No. There's oh, too oh. much going on. Okay. So what are we doing? I don't know. Okay, we'll, we'll read but it we're again. We're gonna try this. I know you read it pretty slow, but it's me here. Read it again. <laughs> Pour oat milk powder into cup. Save okay. pouch. Hold on. Oh, All right, oh, we got oh, the oh, oat oh, milk oh, powder. Is that what that is? What's it smell like? It smells like purple. So we're pouring that in here. Yes? Uh-huh. Measure, okay. Uh-huh. Okay, so purple powder goes in here. It's like science. It's like Willy Wonka. <laughs> <laughs> Fill empty pounds with cold water, stir it into this, and top with this granola, I'm assuming. Okay, hold on. We'll get it, guys, we'll get it. Cold water pouch. Uh, uh, uh. uh. Okay. Now you take your hefty spoon. Your hefty spoon, that's... <laughs> okay, okay, we got some purple water. Okay, we got purple water. Check. Checking of the purple water. Purpling the water, <laughs> check. <laughs> it's a little bit clumpy. Oh, Keeps, cool. Keep, um, Can I have a real spoon? Um, no. That's part of the experience. I'm getting a real spoon, I'm not getting an experience. <laughs> Why don't we just use things that work? Uh, okay. Can you see this, guys? It's purple. It's purple water with lumps. Can I please start? <laughs> with lumps. Okay, then you take your granola, which look like little purple and white Rice Krispies. Which I'm not mad at. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's very watery. It smells kind of weird. Okay, are we going? Go for it. Can you see this, my friends? It's... Does this taste like watery cereal? Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. That's not bad. We've all had some watery cereal. But... You don't, you're not happy. What flavor is this know. supposed to be? <laughs> What? There's zero flavor. Yeah, purple sweet potato granola. But there's no flavor. Texturally, it's great. I wish it tastes like something. <laughs> the next one here is actually, it's a tea. Uh, Miracle Tree Super Caffeinated Moringa Infusion Cherry Chamomile. Uh, we can, again, try this another time. But Miracle Tree in general, this tea brand, I love. It's so good. Like, when mm -hmm. they say cherry chamomile, they ain't kidding. I know yeah. it already. Like, their teas are so strong in the flavor that they claim to be. And I love them. They're, I don't think I've had one now that this I don't is, like. This is the same brand that does the lemon loaf, right? No, that's Tazo. But the, uh, there was like a blueberry one we got with Miracle Tree. It's just really, really good. All right, the next one in here is Julie's. Uh, these are some pitted organic medjool dates. Now, I just shared with you guys those. That's what was in those peanut butter bars I just made you. Mm -hmm. They're gone. Like, they're good. Gone. They're good. <laughs> and the base of them is medjool dates. These are big ones, too. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> and uh, love big dates. But uh, <laughs> they're like, this is like nature's candies caramel. Like, I'm telling you guys, Ooh. like, I know. It's like candy. Oh, man. It's like caramel. Uh-huh. It's so good. Mm. These are really good. They're really, really fresh. For being in a little box like this, like, they are fresh. Yep. Those are good. Dang. That, mm, 
Mm -hmm. I am really excited to try this, you guys. We are huge, huge fans of Go Macro Bars, like huge fans. And like, like it's bad and he's waiting for it. But uh, they recently came out with, about two months ago, I think now, and I still have yet to try it though, the double chocolate and peanut butter chips. It's called Smooth Sanctuary uh, Flavor. It's their newest flavor, so yeah. we've got to get into this. Now, they, uh. I know, I know. They have a peanut butter and chocolate one already. They do. They do, and it's delicious. So mm -hmm. I'm curious to see how different it really is. It's a little darker than the other uh -huh. one. Uh-huh. We love Go Macro Bars. Highly recommend them. I feel like they're really good on Ooh. your stomach and everything, too. Sometimes, like, protein bars in general. Smell that. Dude. Can be really, <laughs> like, rough. No, these are awesome. They're actually clean. Considered certified clean certified raw for being that and they're like our favorites that is chocolate That's oh my goodness mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. it's just like a brownie oh my goodness. it's good huh wow you crying a little bit this is pretty wild mm -hmm. look there's actual little peanut butter chips I, in i'm it. seeing them right now you see them i see them baby mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, we're just going to eat this now. Yeah, you got to give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> I'll all go macro. They're so good. You can pretty much find them anywhere now for the most part. That might be a new favorite. They're just so hefty. Mm. If you're craving chocolate, you're welcome. Like that is, it was made Ooh. for you. That is good. Mm. That is good. Mm -hmm. Next one is by the Soulful Project. We've actually tried this before. Um, it is like a little package of oatmeal just for on the go, for travel. It's very, very good. This one, and the last but not least, is the Unisoy Vegan Jerky. We love most jerkies out there that are vegan. Some, no, um, but most of them we do. And this, uh, I believe we have tried before, but it's been a while. And this is, I think we have the cracked pe black pepper flavor, which I'm having high hopes for too. I don't know if I've tried this brand. Really? I think I have. I must've tried it with my other boyfriend. I like the texture. Hmm. You don't like it? Oh yeah. I mean, it's hard to chew. It's 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 jerky. Come on, really? Mmm. It's good. It's almost like a turkey jerky, not like beef jerky, but like turkey jerky. Why? The texture's different. No. It was good. It didn't blow me. Okay, so the other one that we get from Thrive That's like bad. blows me away. Same this one, Bill one, I think. Is yeah. Okay. This one is good. It's just, that one, I think, just set the bar for me. I oh, needed them. Bomb. So, the main ingredient, first one listed, is textured vegetable protein, which TVP, you'll see, like, the abbreviation for. It's crazy. We've been vegan for four years and have yet to actually play with that ingredient yet. It's a good one because it is, you know, protein in a different, you know, form than what we're used to with mostly tofus and tempehs and seitan and all that, but... Mm -hmm. I love it. It is like, it's hard to chew. That's what you're going for when you want jerky. You're wrong. There's different styles of jerky. It's not right and wrong. It's wrong. So that was everything for the May box. Everything's a blur right now. I'm like, May? Is it May? Where are we? What day is it? It's the getting toward the end of May. Hold on to that. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Probably halfway through the year. Try again, 2020. <laughs> anyway, what was your favorite? My favorite. This is a hard one. They were all pretty good. Okay, I'm I'm going to say the go macro, yeah. but I could have told you that yeah. before we started. Okay, I agree. Oh, um, second runner up. The protein cookie. Runner, oh, oh. Yeah, that yeah. was good. I would get that like in the, the store if I see plus. it. Cookie plus. Yeah, yeah cookie you need to plus. remember where you saw it. I think it was at a gas station. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But that one okay. was super good. Delicious. I thought the pig out pork rinds were really good though too. But it, they just, for me, like again, they kind of mimicked like a pop chip for me. So it wasn't like, oh my God, I've never had something like this. Yeah. But they're very good. They are. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed watching again, please give this video a thumbs up. And 
thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye guys. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, get it, get it, get it. Oh. Okay, you guys want back more? I like your back. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Damn it! <laughs> Kylie Jenner put fruit in her water, so I put fruit in my water. How do you want it? Well. I think I saw these advertised on the internet. Did you see them on the old Facebook? <laughs> I did. Those are so big you might not be able to get two in the mouth at the same time. I think I can handle it. Like a super like elegant looking cow. That ain't your grandma's cow. <laughs> Damn it, Jim. But I called my boyfriend's daddy. Something smells like ass. Pardon. Uh, Give me no. that date. 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 Oh. Date. Just a little flavor. You're still here. You've arrived. How lovely. <laughs>